Hi, I'm Allie, and I'm Living Chronic Faith. Thanks for stopping by. If you are blessed to have people in your life who care about your health, then you may have at some point been bombarded by a variety of different opinions on how you should manage your health care. And when you know that these people are well-meaning, and some may even have some experience in the area about which they're commenting, it can be a little difficult to navigate and even harder to know which opinion to believe and which route to take. Listen, everybody is different. And what works for one person doesn't necessarily work the same way for another person. There are all sorts of things being said in the social media. There are things being said on the news. There are things being said by random people that you don't even know. And then you have your loved ones that want the best for you. And they're giving you the sum total of the things that they've heard in the same outlets that you've heard. Here's what I want to recommend. I want to recommend that the first thing that you do is go to God for guidance. The Bible tells us, do not be anxious about anything, but in every situation by prayer and petition, with thanksgiving, present your request to God. All these different opinions and different suggestions, they can cause anxiety. They can cause nervousness and not knowing which direction to turn, which path to take. But I encourage you to go to God with those questions. Seek his counsel first. All the others, you can take those with a grain of salt. But seek what the Lord would have you to do in every situation, including and especially managing your health care. And then I encourage you to bring your physician into the conversation. After you've heard from the Lord and he's led you into what to do, ask your physician what the best way is to carry that out. God has gifted physicians with the knowledge and the ability to assist us and to help us. And yes, we believe God for healing. We believe God that he is the one that guides us, but he also uses physicians that he has equipped to be a blessing to us on our healthcare journey. So I encourage you to do those things. Do not feel the pressure to take on all of the opinions and the suggestions because there's no way to do all of them. There's no way to take everyone's advice. So the advice that you should absolutely always take is the counsel of the Holy Spirit. And I encourage you to seek him for the next move today. I love you and I'm praying for you. God bless you. I'll talk to you soon.